Hey everybody, uh, I'm here at NSS this week. Ooh, sorry. <laughs> hey everybody, I'm here at NSS this week. Uh, I'm here today with Maisie B and Nick Flair. How are you going, guys? Good. Good, thank you. Going very well, thank you. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Thanks for Lovely. asking. Uh, for anyone who isn't aware, can you guys just fill us in on who you are and what you do? Yeah. Oh, should I hold? Thank you. Um, my name is Maisie. Um, I'm a singer-songwriter in the indie pop sort of vicinity. Um, I also study saxophone at the con in the jazz course. My name is Nick, and I'm a producer. I'm a part of East Ave. We're a um, like a three-piece hip-hop group out of Adelaide here. And so it's me and a couple other friends, and yeah, I do the production work with the boys, and I'm starting to work with a couple other people in Adelaide, but yeah, that's it. Fantastic. Uh, so you guys are here this week for Songs, the, uh, the, the program where you guys are creating a brand new song every single day for five days. Mm -hmm. um, how do you guys feel about having the time limit of just one day to create a song from scratch? I like it. I really like it. I think it's um, it's good. I like having that time pressure. Mm, yeah. And it's, it's been awesome working with everybody, like with new people, because that, I don't know, the energy that you get from the other people doesn't make it hard to make something in a day. But if I was going to go like by myself and sit in the studio and try and make something, like a full finished song in a day, I might find that more difficult. Mm. But I think with other people, it's one day is perfect. Mm. Yeah, it really forces... Like, I'm very self-critical and I'll, you know, start an idea and then probably just scrap it. <laughs> but, like, having someone else in the room to kind of egg you on with ideas that you might not go through with yourself mm -hmm. is really good and it also stops you because you're kind of like, oh, well, I have to get something down. Mm -hmm. So even if yeah. it's not perfect, it's still, you have to just try and make it work, which is, yeah. Mm. And I feel like having those, like, limitations kind of helps bring out those ideas that, you may not have gotten otherwise and like creations that may not have happened without the kind of limitations. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, so each day the combination of producers, instrumentalists and artists is changed. So every day people are working with people they haven't worked with before. How do you guys feel about, about that, about working with someone new every single day? It's really cool. Um, sorry. <laughs> it's really cool to um, deal with different genres that like I've never done like the hip-hop sort of mm. stuff that we're doing today. I've never mixed with that genre before, but I'm really enjoying it. Um, it really pushes you out of your comfort zone, I guess. Yeah, totally. Yeah, yeah. it's it's great because it's like, um, I mean, Maisie does, like, as you said, like indie indie rock pop yeah, stuff. Pop. Mm. It's like we're just on in different worlds, really. So yeah, exactly. the different <laughs> different levels of ideas that are coming through each day, it's awesome. And it's such a good opportunity to to practice you know, going into sessions with different kinds of people and being able to come up with something all together. Mm. It's fantastic. Yeah. Mm. Awesome. Uh, Macy, you just released an EP pretty recently, I understand. Uh, tell us a little bit about that. Sure. Um, me and my friend made it at home. Um, it's four songs that I wrote a couple years ago and I just felt that they needed their own little place together. Um, before I move forward. Um, it's very like nostalgic for that time of my life, I guess, a couple of years ago. Mm. Um, but they're still songs that like are really special to me, I guess. Um, and I only ever used to play them, just me and my guitar at gigs. So it's been really fun to like add um, lead parts, lead guitar parts and then keys and drums and, and bass um, to make it really, yeah, that indie pop sort of vibe. Um, yeah, and then I've recently, like, played the launch gig on Friday, so I put a band together, which has been, like, amazing as well to do that with friends. Um, yeah. It was really fun on Friday night to play it live as well. Fantastic. So, yeah. Yeah. It's amazing. <laughs> uh, and, Nick, as you said, you're in East Ave. Uh, what have you guys been up to recently? Um, just a lot a lot of writing. We had, uh, earlier in the year, we put, put out a couple tracks, um, after our first EP, which was, we had a song called Do It All Again with George Alice. And then we mm. had um, a song with uh, Raj Mahal from Sydney. Mm. And that was called Olympic. So we had like this random kind of two song release. And then it's just been writing since then. So we've, I don't know, man. I think maybe the start of next year we might 
put out these next ones. Hell yeah. But um, we'll have to wait and see. Hopefully soon, because we've been writing a lot and pretty keen to put something out. Yeah. Sick. Yeah. yeah, that's so exciting. Awesome. Uh, well, thanks so much for joining us today, guys. Thank you. Uh, really appreciate your time, and it's lovely chatting with you. Thanks very much. <laughs> and Thank thanks you. so much for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time. <laughs>